I think the best way to do this is to, to talk about a, a fellow named Arthur Samuel. Um, Samuel programmed a computer to play checkers. And the interesting thing about this is that Samuel wasn't a good checkers player. And that's what illustrates the key idea behind machine learning. He didn't use his expertise of the game and then teach the program rules on how to play checkers based on his mastery of the game. He simply had the computer play thousands of hands against itself and learn strategies that maximize winning the game, which was really the only thing he programmed into it. Um, you know, in other words, he just said that he programmed the computer to win the game. So author Samuel has a great definition of machine learning. He says it's the field of study that gives, uh, that gives a computer the ability to learn without being explicitly programmed. Um, and I think that's just a great working definition. And there are three or four subcategories of machine learning, depending on how you want to define it. Supervised learning, unsupervised learning, recommender systems, and re reinforcement learning. And we're going to look at some examples of each briefly. <clears throat> 